Hello and welcome back to the Gatekeeper's Grove by night for what will be our level 15 recording of Red Reborn. We're going to have the pleasure of the Bear's Company once more on this uh, bank character and as you might be able to tell from the uh, colourful uh, rune arm animation there we've at least uh, changed that. So let's give you a quick look at the, the gear as it stands. There she is, our B storage. B stands <laughs> for Bayleaf and his uh, main character. So I've taken the tough decision and got rid of all the little set bonuses we had. We've just got the Shan one now, but we do have some uprated gear, not least of which this um, uh, trinket boosting the reconstruction power. We've just picked up um, Reconstruct as our first six level spell and as you can see no you can't because the lag's eaten it let's try that again there we go <laughs> delayed reaction so that's outside of uh, reaper but i think in even in low reaper it's still going to be pretty much a one click heal to max so that's nice it's just a shame i can't give the same to annie although i have these vials for her which as we can see are not too oh that wasn't great uh, it's, they're not amazing are they i think my positive spell power must be uh lacking at the moment and positive. you don't need to bother about it because of me <laughs> yeah my positive spell power is pretty rubbish i'm afraid i don't have anything helping that at the moment uh part of the family set then family recruit sigil awesome item for us true seeing so we don't have the problem anymore of the uh of uh blurry targets and that kind of thing armor piercing relentless fury just an awesome item for any melee or ranged um wall watch sorry it's not the part of the family set is it that's just the recruit sigil from that set we're having the wall watch set so we've got the hat with some nice things there accuracy double shot the docent with our fort and repair amp false life sapphire of shatter on there for our uh, dcs on our beloved uh, thunder shock attack which is up over the 50 now in reaper and the gloves otherwise it's pretty much uh, all changed with the gear, just some bog standard glasses. Deadly we're not bothered about because it's on the neck piece, but Seeker I don't think we have anywhere else, so that's nice. I've put my beloved Golden Greaves in for some damage reduction. Um, a canis crafted pair of um, braces I had, nice defensive item that. On there alone there's nine on save, so that's great. Um, Ghostly is on the ring here, the Celestial Ring, so that's nice to have. Uh, still got the Trappy Keylock Ring from Ravenloft Belt, I couldn't find any better than that. The only thing that really helps us on there is the Ram's Might, I think that's two on damage, so it's better than nothing. A Kenneth Crafted Cloak we had, Insightful Intel will certainly help us. Uh, I upgraded our Quiver. Dynamistic Quiver, ranged power too, I suppose they all help. The double shot is duplicated on the hat, so that won't help. And Tira Splendor, Rune Arm. I think this comes from one of the bosses in the subterrain, which is in access from the middle of the marketplace. And it's one of these that is Kenneth Craftable. So you can see there I've got all our uh, uh, magnetism needs on there for our imbue. So hopefully we'll see an improvement on that. Enhancements wise, as mentioned, I've gone up in the uh, Warforged tree. So we've got three extra on tack DCs. We've got the nice little bonus now to ranged power two in there. And with a couple of other points I had spare, I put those in for another uh, action boost. So we're up to eight now action boost which is nice per rest uh, I was about to forget to add the reaper cause in let's go ahead and do that now uh, do we actually want that one I think it, yeah it's gonna take us on to the next one isn't it what do we want I guess we take decks ok 
Okay. Now, are we bothered? Yeah, we are bothered about this, aren't we? Because we can have more intelligence in there. At least for now. I might reorganise this when we get to the cap. It's one of, as mentioned before, it's one of the few builds I've done where we've been in three different Reaper trees because intelligence uh, and spell power are in the middle one. Normally for a ranged I would be in Dread and Grim. Okay, I think that's about it. Now the bear has been asking me where we are going for the... Uh, questing this time and I deliberately haven't told her because I wanted the reaction to be live on the recording you see this mm. little portal here little portal mm. this is where we are wow. going madam what really we are mm. so this, so this will mark the first time the bear has set foot in the myth expansion uh Unbeknownst Wait, to her, I have added the expansion on her account while she was uh, oh a well. So. Oh my god! Oh my god! Thank you so much. I don't even knew. If you'd like thank to you. come and pick up the quests here. It's sneaky, sneaky creature. Yes. So you did it while I was on my nap. I did. <laughs> He's sneaky. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm. So, what did, what's your first impression of the? Uh, well, the staging uh, it, area? Remember, it remembers me a little bit of Isle of Dread, with what I can see here. Uh huh. I don't know why, why, but you know the the walls in there remembers me of the Isle of Dread. The feedback from the wilderness is very positive. Where are you? I'm just collecting all the quests around the, the central uh, area. I think I've uh, got them all. Now, I've only done four in here. We'll try and do one or two of the ones that um, that I've done, depending on how we go time-wise and how you, how you are for time. Where... Now that I have, the, I have the expansion, I don't even want to go out anymore. <laughs> you do. No, who who needs to have dinner? Mm -mm. Uh, mm -mm. I don't uh, need that. Bear does, especially if you've made a commitment to uh, Fatima. Have I got stuff? Oh. No, I'm. There's a boat down here, which is, I think, the uh, access way to the wilderness area. When you're ready, have you collected all the quests, or do you want me to share them? I, I think I did. If I did do it well. Okay. Oh. Go to the wilderness on the so, boat. Oh, she's stepping in for the first time. Let's gauge the reaction here. <laughs> I like it. Let I, me I see. I think it's is. great, this wilderness. I must say, it's a very big <laughs> wilderness map. Quite wow. rich in uh, greenery. But I'm not going to spoil it for you. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like it. Okay. The first quest is up there, isn't it? Yeah. I am completely clueless to where I need to go. <laughs> well, I'm not much better, but as we, we have quite a long way to go, you'll get to see some of the... Uh... Look, at, look at the houses in here. I very know. Well... They're of a certain oh. size, aren't they? Yeah, very well draw. You know, different of other places other it's a shame you know. we're in here on night time because uh, the sun shining through some of these trees is quite nice too look at the mist effects up in the uh, in the air here I've got a, a sort of a misty thing going on mm, yeah now these are Maybe can you see more. can you see there in front of us that uh, mm. spot on the ground with the sort of kaleidoscope of colour. Can you see? Uh. That's a wild magic area, wild magic zone. And what happens in if there? If you step in there and uh, let's try casting something. Oh, I'm, I'm classed as being underwater. There are, there are two types of zone, a wild magic zone, which can cause these wild magic surges, both positive and negative. Mm. 
And then there are dead null magic zone or dead magic zone or something, which oh. does as it suggests. You can't cast in there. It just seems like I am high on mushrooms. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's show. I'm going to show off the new rule now, the light spirals, because I quite like the effect. Oh, it didn't do much there, did it? It sort of died in the ground. I don't know why. Maybe because of the wild magic zone. Let's try that and again. This, Nothing. There we this go. This wild magic zone uh, follows me? I don't know. No. It's just a zone. Well, while we're inside the zone... See, I've got... See, oh, I oh, had... Hi. I had a little... When you have one of the surges, you have a little spot over your head. And the colour of the, the mark indicates the uh, type of surge it's going to be so a green one would be a good one red one would be a negative one wild magic zone no i am still having wild magic zone thing effect oh now now no, it went off. You, you were still in the zone look there's a big zone behind us there ah i thought it was a small that's Trying that's what to happened get us oh. to a quest here i wish i could remember <laughs> which one this one is but i have to say i can't la, 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 la. but the quest is here we made it okay now let's mm. not go crazy here we'll we're learning aren't we we'll leave it on uh, reaper one i think all right well, I don't have Reaper points, so for me it's fine. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. <laughs> hmm. This is definitely one of the ones I had done before, but uh, that doesn't mean to say it will go smoothly. I haven't done any of them on Heroic. We just did four on Legendary with Clitch and a couple of others. If you need remove curse, remove disease, or lesser restoration, I have it. Nice one. So you have some elements of paladin in that build, then. I saw. I thought I saw you using a smite before. Mhm. Mm Give you some energy resist. Do you have energy resists on your build? Mm, no, I don't think no. so. I have jump if you want. Uh, I don't have jump as a spell. Nice one. Paladin doesn't have jump. He's a funny old build you've got there. <laughs> He's a mishmash. It sounds like it, but it's it sounds quite effective. Okay, first crest, then crest of the sword, which we put in here. Now, if you look on your map, you can see already there's a snake socket here. This is an optional. We don't go in. Oh, I, actually, to show you, we could go in there, couldn't we? But we need to find the crests now to fit several sockets. Oh, oh. Yellow. Now, did you see they all had little bits over their heads for the wild magic I thing? I think this is a yeah, dead end. But but this is good or bad for us? I don't know if the wild magic it is good or bad. It can be both good and bad, depending. Mm. And how will I know if I want to be on the wild magic zone or not? Uh, well, in your case, you don't do a lot of casting, do you? So you're not likely to be doing too much with it. So we're looking for... See, there's another... Um, another slot here to put a crest so we found two and you can see on the map it's marking them for us so we're, we're looking for crests to feed into those slots and another one okay
careful there's a boss in there. Okay, he's gone. Remnants here if wanted. So we've found all the sockets, we just have no crests at the moment. <laughs> oh, a load of things, pile of things there the bear's left for me, that's typical bear. An absolute pile, and you just wandered off and left them. In fairness, they took some time to uh, to appear, so... Yeah, I don't knew this was going on. I I'll don't give you the it. benefit of the doubt. Spot hidden. We've got a secret door here. I don't know if oh, this is... A crest. There what? is a crest. That you've got a crest? Good stuff. No, there is a crest on the end of the thing. I don't got it. All oh, right. Well, there's a chest here. Crest, chest. Now, one of my okay. gripes about this... Oh, are you needing help? Where are you? Oh, God, is she needing help? Trust the bear to sniff out trouble. One of my gripes about this chain in general is the... Uh, the fact that any optional chest is just complete trash. There's no... no filigree legendary, no nice things at all. Except in the end chests. No named loot. You get drop. the crest. Oh. Did you know that was going to happen? Oh, I was... The electric. No. That's an interesting thing to note. The electric heals those beggars. Okay, that's the end, Danny. Let's not uh, go down there for now. That's that's where we go when we've found all the crests. So we've got one so far, haven't we? Aren't we amazing? Ah, oh, just like in the... What is the place that is the quest of the thousand levers? Yes. Here is the place of the quest the of the thousand quest crests. Quest of the thousand crests, yes. And it's been mentioned about this chain in general. I haven't done enough of the quest to comment, but it's been mentioned that uh, not not just one of the quests is like that. Put it that way. The Thousand Lovers quest is on the Isle of Dread, right? Nope. It is on, on the, the Salt, Salt Marsh. Marsh. Salt Marsh, yes, was my second guess. So that's two crests we've got. What do you think to the... Uh, this was one the... Um, oh, boss! I am enjoying to see some little different enemies, you know? Like the, those warmy things. I, I thought Carry it was crawler, quite... Yes, we've got Nothics up here. And there is a crest up here, I think. Uh, they created another enemy for me to hit and kill. Yes. And I like that enemy to kill. I like it. I have heard, I, I haven't it. seen it yet, but I have heard that there is an enormous one of those, a raid boss, in the oh, wilderness. Very good. Just like Dune. <laughs> yes, just like that. Mm -hmm. I like it. That's what I'm hearing, that there's an enormous one, and apparently... It wiped out the whole of Zavina's party, so it must be tough. <laughs> it was all who told aye. me that. And there were, you know, all the the known people in there. I would... At least for once, it was me that caused the party wipe, right? <laughs> <laughs> would you like to share that with the rest of the room? There was a time, you know... Uh, me, myself, I consider myself a forever noob, because, well, that is it, is a fact. I think you could say we're all and... in that category in the bear party. <laughs> and um, the leader of my my guild just was just teaching me like what I needed to do in one raid. What was that raid I was doing? You you know the name? It was, I think it was Killing Time, the one with the shadows, isn't it? Yeah, so we was doing that and she was t saying to me, oh, whenever we we go there, don't, don't steam ahead, you know, just wait for other people to get the shadows. 
you know, because if you get the shadows, you will get killed. So don't go ahead, you know, just wait. And she was all the way up, you know, during the quest, telling me that, sending me tells to teach me. And it just seems to happen that I don't knew where I was supposed to behave and not run ahead. So when I got to that room, I thought, well, a free room to go! Yay! <laughs> and charge in. And just suddenly, like, like, no! No, me! No, me! No! And, <laughs> and uh, the rest of the group went boom. Yeah, the shadows appeared, everything was not tidy, not planned, not strategically done, and the shadows appeared, we wasn't prepared. You, you take and any. Everyone died, you know, with no chance to come back. And um, I had a mix of, oh my god, what I did, and uh, laughing like with the, the, the disaster that was, and crying because I was like killing all the party. <laughs> So I think like, we could, would I, would I be correct in saying you were upset for about 10 minutes afterwards? And no, I, the... I, I, I was very sad. I was very sad that day, you know, I, I even cried. Yes, but... but for the several months following that infamous episode, you lived off the notori notoriety, didn't you? Yeah, <laughs> someone now knows and remembers about that day. Okay, now we can go to the uh, the end room. Now that it had passed, I can laugh about it, but in the day yes. I was feeling like... Oh, I, I would have felt the same to, to think that I'd, uh, I'd uh, messed everything up for everyone. It's not nice, is it? But every now and then I need to do a Leroy Jenkins, you know. <laughs> but I, to be fair, I think what happened there more than anything else was you hadn't understood properly the instructions were, that were being given and you didn't feel comfortable asking for them to be repeated so you just kind of I, I, knew, I knew that there was a place where i should stop and wait but i don't knew where it was ah. so <laughs> so i think we go through this portal now yeah this must be the leader of the Another crest. It seems yep, we never it's crest time. Do we need to shrine here? No, I think we're okay. Unless you need to shrine. No, I'm fine. I'm okay. So we're looking for the icon of the elves. I think. I just swing it away. I think this That's may be about. the boss fight, Annie. I fear no boss. Okay then. Where did he go? I think he's teleported uh, maybe down to the bottom somewhere. Where is he? Ah. Okay. I think that's it. We just put the crest in here. Is that? And there's an icon here. And that is Chesticus. Chesticus. Now, as mentioned, if we find anything, you can have it for your B storage character. See if you can. But I wouldn't be too optimistic about finding anything, because from what I've heard, the loot drop rate is pretty low. All right. But that didn't go too badly, did it? Okay. I like it to swing a weapon. Yeah. <laughs> With but... a bit of luck, we might get you a Reaper point. What was the uh, XP given there? Not terrible. 17k for yeah, me. Not terrible. I'm, I'm hearing mm -hmm. people, a lot of people saying this won't get used as an alternative to Giant Hold because of the length of time spent running to quests and length of time to complete them. I you think know. I will, or I might do both together, or bits of both. You always do the same things for the sake of the XP, like, you I, know. I mentioned this the other day, I think if, if they were to put out an expansion with... Um... Talk and walk, talk and walk. 
if they, I'm just trying to decide which one to go to. If they were to put out an expansion with uh, with just one empty room and a chest to open, and you immediately got a hundred thousand XP and just rinse and repeat, I bet you a number of people would pay. Oh, what's this? Would pay handsomely for that. Like it. like it. Yeah, what is the point on just, you know, oh yeah, let's go to 32 and come back. You know, it gets a little bit exhaustive if you don't have fun in the middle. Because then, you know, comes the burnout. It's a game, not a job. I, I must, yeah, I, I agree. I must say that since I've had a lot more balance to my game, like not just doing the hamster wheelie thing, taking time to play uh, several builds at the cap. And um, who is who is the fault of it? Who is the one to blame for it? Me! <laughs> for what? For playing at the cap? No, for you to try and oh, for me different to, yes, things. Yes, yes, I was, well, at, back in the day I was fixed on Warlock because that was what I knew. And yes, it was the bear who convinced me, actually, she was the one I think you'd played with a druid in one of the public rooms hadn't you and you mm -hmm. decided you thought I might uh, quite like that so we gave it a go and we never looked back did we now aside from the bear project I have planned another thing I would like to do would be to show the full leveling as a druid because their leveling process, in my opinion at least, is quite interesting. They start off with only single target damage, which uh, has some nice things like one-shotting reapers with the lightning bolt thing, but also some, uh, some drawbacks. The lack of AoE is a, an issue. Oh, she's not going to wait for me, is she? Okay. Yet you hear faint sounds from up ahead. Mm. Okay, big room with lots of things here, I think, to clear out. Come to me, enemies. Come to me. Come to me. Now, do we have a... We don't have a D-Door, do we? Right, so the two sides... Can you see there's a hand over there and there's a star here? We go to the star side <laughs> first. Oh, we've got... What, what are you laughing at? Because you said you have a hand over there and I was waiting to have a feet on the other. <laughs> have a hand over there, have a feet on the other. But no, I wasn't expecting to be a star. Okay, keep going, keep going. Forget it's about right. the best. No, you carry on. Um, no, there silliness. is a star here and we, we go in the star side first and we're looking for a crest to open up the right. other side now and that's oh hello now I honestly can't tell you whether we should go this way or the other way I don't know what's in there Ah, that's no, that's just... No, 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 no! Come back, come back, come back, come back! It's trapped. There's a corridor full of loads of traps and... and, uh, and... I got some elements from other places, like these big doors that comes for from that... Um, you remember the place we go to play that raid with the two dragons? This, Thunderhome. This quest... Thunderhome. Yeah, Thunderhome. This place here is remember a lot about the thunder home glitch was the telling me the um background for it, it it's uh like an el old elven stuff apparently oh <laughs> chaos crawlers <laughs> casting spells wow that's uh unexpected oh we've got some things down here all right Hungry undead, they should be right up your street. <laughs> undead have to eat too, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now there's a as long as they symbol over this uh, door. Maybe that's telling us the way. 
fountain. Yes, I remember the fountain. I think most of the things in this quest have jumped up out of the floor. It's a shame I haven't got undead as a favoured enemy. Let's click on the fountain for Featherfall and we're going to be going up this uh, reverse gravity thing. Whee! And we just bob down here to this door and then basically we can... Are you, Wait, are you I there? don't know what is happening. Sorry, I was wrong, Annie. We don't go up just yet. We have, oh, we have to go through here, pull a lever to raise the ceiling in that other room. Mm -hmm. This so makes now, sense. Now we can drift up further on this draft. And then same thing again. We have another lever on the same side, I think. There, that's it. No Where's monster. the worms? I thought I thought I was looking for them too. They the wormy have, they, worms. They must have not got the memo for this one. Okay, so next <laughs> one up. Oh. No, I it's fall. all right. You can um, you can pop back up again. There's no problem. Another lever, and now we should be clear to go to the top. <sighs> this reverse light gravity is being... Uh, not good. No bueno. Now, if this wasn't on the family channel, I'm sure she would have said a big S-H-I-T there. Uh, shit is not a bad word. It's a necessity. Now, uh... Ah... Can you make your way to where you can see me here? Uh, oh, okay. Because I think there is a door at the end. Oh, no, I'm wrong. There's a door at the end of one of them that we have to go in. There is a shrine here which we don't need at the moment. Where is that door, then? Is it below me? Is it this one? I think it's this one here. There's a door, is there? Nope. Just a pile of undead. I'm doing a very good job of showing the fact I've only played through here once. There is a door stuck behind that. I think I found a door. You it's on the last level. Door on the top level? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm following you. No, I got it wrong. No door there. Maybe I was going too low. Ah, I see where you are. Okay. Thank you. And you look like you found some company as well in here. I don't went ahead because they are all archers ah. and I don't like them. And they are not brave enough to come and face me. Uh -uh. So we're looking for a crest in here somewhere, <clears throat> which then would open up the other side, the side with the hand, believe it or not. The hand. A faint sense of unease yes. You. Oh, hello, boss. Oh, hello. Hello, boss. This crest likely fits the socket of a doormat. A crest. Right. Nice right. one. Okay. So back down. And well, a D door would have been great, but we don't have one, so let's try to retrace our steps. Now, the one of the problems with this quest, uh, unfortunately, the map isn't right. You can see it's uh, it's um, I mean, all this area we have explored already, but it's acting like we haven't. So it's becoming quite mm -hmm. difficult to know where we've been and where we haven't. Trying to what a shock! Did what... you being a bit buggered? 
Yeah, it's. Uh, I, I guess it's one of the pitfalls of um, being. Oh, lots of things here. It's one of the downsides of being one of the first into the new expansion instead of waiting as I always have in the past. Ah, you, it's fine. You, you get to try to uh, help with the ironing out of some of the bugs. Souls for you, Annie, both? Uh, you can take one. No, you take you take all. My only utility is to swing my weapon, nothing else. Well, you can heal yourself with the souls, can't you? So we're going through the uh, hand area. And I think I'm missing my exploding shot for those things. I think... Um, for, oh my god. I think for where we're going, there's a remnant here if you want it. Where we're going is signposted with the hand later on. Super. More things coming. Fear Reaper. Okay, now which way is it? Do we see any signpost with a hand? A hand, hand here. You do? Great stuff. Right. Uh, hmm. Now then, a hand is there as well. This place is remembering me of Ravenloft. This, yes, definitely. You take. You got something else in there, Annie? From behind a doorway. Ruin zombie. Not much, just a little silly zombie. Now here, we were hunting around for ages in this room. Are you okay in there? Wait, I, I see. Hunting around for ages, looking for another crest to fit this. When in actual fact, you have to speak to the door itself, or the voice behind the door. And we were looking around for ages, not realising that, so that was a little bit uh, frustrating. Now there's going to be things coming, I think, from behind, now we've spoken. Low move to come from the behind. It's a low I think, move. I think so, at least. Uh, no, maybe not. Oh, I thought I thought it opened up once we'd done that. Maybe we have to find a crest in this area as well. Oh God, this could be another. We were in here for an hour, <laughs> looking round. Yeah, especially because the map doesn't work yes, properly. Yes, it's very unfortunate, that. I could have sworn that that door, you just speak to it, and uh, we can use enemies as a an indicator of uh, if we've been somewhere or not. I could have sworn that... Uh, that thing was you just went up there and spoke to the door and you got through i thought the other crest was oh maybe not maybe i'm confusing it with another another quest i must be there's nothing to be done there is there <laughs> so i guess somewhere on <coughs> Oh, I've got I've got this bad feeling though. I've got a really bad feeling. I'm going to check the uh, wiki because otherwise we could be in here for hours. Yeah, good idea. Death hosts this banquet. Mm -hmm. 
choo 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 That's the good thing with discovering people. Discovering. Yeah, a load of uh, things. Can't find the crest. Advance all. This is in the DDO form. Advance all quest objectives you come across. What free, do you think about the free old yeah. dream from the magic barrier? The great hall. Oh, that's it, Annie. You found it. It's in the Great Hall. Uh, I remember now. You've got a load of enemies there and the crest on yeah. the floor. One of them drops the yeah. crest. I can see it. <laughs> well done, Bear. So if you don't have the wiki to find out for you, just Bring release the a... Release the bear. Unleash, unleash a bear and they will find. <laughs> because they have a very good... Very good nose to Bears smell. Have a nose for trouble, yes. Oh my god. <laughs> if have a trouble to be found on the quest, I will certainly find <laughs> Did you find trouble? Jesus, look at all this. <laughs> this is unbelievable. You know, that's the bear. I, the, I, I didn't even have enough boost to kill them all. You didn't, you didn't just unearth one group, you unearthed the whole lot. There's a shrine actually in the corner here, Annie. Can you see next to me? You could probably reach that. That's the very no shape and form. <laughs> you found the crest, though. I did. Well done, bear. <laughs> so that's the thing. You go to the door, speak to the door, then D-door back to this start area, pick up the second crest and go back into the hand thing to complete. Well done. I just have to rest here. Oh, you're uh, resting. Okay. Let me... In fact, all, no, none of my buffs are still going either. Let's give you a death ward. Thank you, thank you very much. Let's go. Okay. To where? Okay. So back into the hand room, back to that door that we just came from. And that, I think, is the end of the quest. I wish uh, the map would stay filled in, but hey-ho. So this isn't actually that long when we know what we're doing. Mm -hmm. I think now, put this crest in and I think this... Oh, hello. Forgotten about you. Nice. I think we've got some more things in here, have we? No, maybe not. Maybe that's the that was the end boss. Easy, easy. You found the yeah, icon of it the was. Bringing you closer to okay. The key to the nice job. Now to return to the elf. Yay! I have a lunar gem of charisma here. Mm. Slotted effect. Two profane bonus on charisma. It is bound to character or to it's account? It's bound... Uh, no, actually it's not. So, so I'll, you I'll take hang it. on to it and then if uh, we come to want... It has to yeah. go in. It has to be slotted into an item from this chain though. It's like a set bonus thing from this chain. Mm -hmm. You take it. I don't yet have an item from the chain, so because I've, I've been the the rare ones I did find, I gave to the others because I don't think I'll be making any uh, gear out of here. Maybe the odd bit in heroic might be helpful. We'll see. It's the first augment in legendary or heroic that I've found. I think this would be a good spot to end the recording. 
because we could at any stage end up wandering around lost, couldn't we? Which isn't exactly great viewing. So hope uh, you guys enjoyed the, the first uh, foray of the bear into the uh, myth. As mentioned, I've only seen the four quests closest to the porting point, as we, of which those were two. So I look forward to discovering uh, the rest of it in due course. And we will speak to you next time. Thanks very much, as always, for looking. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. Speak to you soon.